Webster City Middle School. It's Allie. And Riley. Today is February 3rd. And it's our Valentine's Day show. Let's go hear about Venus from our fifth grade friends. Hey everybody, it's Maddie. You know how last time we were talking about all the planets? Well, today I'm just talking about Venus. Did you know Venus was the only planet named after a goddess? The goddess of love and beauty. Fun fact, on Venus it rains acid and smells metal. No wonder it's the hottest planet. This Valentine's Day will be one to remember. Well, that's all. Now let's go to Brooklyn. Thanks, Maddie. Hi, I'm Brooklyn. In social studies, we are researching the first three English settlements. Since it's Valentine's Day, we're talking about the love story between Pocahontas and John Rolfe. Let's go see some students act out what really happened. A while after the colony of Jamestown was started, a Powhatan Indian captured Captain John Smith. Just when Captain John Smith thought they were going to kill him, Pocahontas saved him. <laughs> Years later, Pocahontas married John Rolfe. After the wedding, there was peace between the colony and tribe. A few years later, after the wedding, John Rolfe took Pocahontas to England, where she became sick and died. Now you know the real love story between Pocahontas and John Rolfe, not the Disney version. Let's hand it on over to the anchors. Thanks for that. Yeah, that was really interesting. Now Reese from the sixth grade is going to tell us about the heart. Valentine's Day is near and love is in the air. Hey, Lynx, this is Reese and I'm here and I'm going to tell you about what we are doing in science. You may know the heart is something that we think of when we think of love, but the heart is definitely not responsible for that emotion. The heart is actually a part of the circulatory system. The heart is made up of atrium and ventricles. The right side of your heart collects the blood, which is low in oxygen, and sends it to the lungs. The blood is now filled with oxygen, and it is sent back to the heart, where the heart contracts and pushes it the blood through the aorta. The, aor the aorta sends it to the rest of the body. Instead of thinking about the about love when you think about the heart, you should think about th all the hard work it does to keep you alive. That's all for from me now. Now let's change the topic from the heart to art with Allie. Hey there, Webster City Middle School. It's Allie here to string together a report about the art project we have been doing. We are making string art. First, we painted a piece of cardboard how we wanted. Then we made designs with the string. Next, we used a needle to thread the string in the design we wanted on our cardboard. We were aiming towards making it look like it had lots of texture. Well, that's it for me, so let's weave it on over to the anchors. That was lovely. During Valentine's Day, some people think about candy, others think about their crushes. Let's go to Adelaide to see who the crushes are. Hey there, WCMS. It's Addie here. As Valentine's Day comes up, we start to think about crushes. And as you all know, middle schoolers have a lot of crushes. Sometimes they can change every week and have even every day. We have a select few of students who will be handing a bottle of crush to give to their crush at lunch. Here's a crush to give to your crush. <laughs> Here's a bottle of crush to give to your crush, Evan. Here's a bottle of crush to give to your crush. Here's a 
bottle of Crush to give to your crush? Here's a crushed hand to your crush. Will you be my crush? <laughs> hey, she accepted it! Woo, 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 woo! That might have been a little embarrassing, but it was, gave us a whole bunch of laughs. Don't be too embarrassed to let your crush know that you like them in case of this upcoming Valentine's Day. Now back to McKaylee with the wrestling segment. Hey WCMS, it's McKaylee, and the wrestling season has come to an end. Their last meet was Thursday, January 26th. So we're going to ask some of the wrestlers about how their personal seasons went. I'm here with Evan, Ben, Caden, Cam, and Abe. So, how do you guys think your personal seasons went? Uh, I think it went pretty good. My season went pretty good. My season was good. Still have more to come. I think it was great. Yeah, it was really good. What was your guys' highlight of the season? When I went in a trip overtime and won. When I got my first pin. Um, in our last meet, I won my match by an escape. I've pinned my first guy, and I'm also happy that I just won my first state title at USA State Championships in Cedar Rapids. When I was down by one in the third period, and I pinned the kid and won. And I was excited to go three and six for my first year of wrestling. Well, that's all for me. Let's wrestle it on over to the anchors. It sounds like the wrestlers have had a great season. Now let's go see what Tavis is cooking up in the kitchen. Hey Webster City Middle School, I'm Tavis and I'm back with another cooking show. Except this time, I'm baking. Valentine's Day is about love and there's nothing I love more than sugar cookies. I have my oven preheating to 350 and my protective eyewear so I don't get hurt. And now I'm ready to make some sugar cookies. I've washed my hands and I'm ready to place the cookie dough in the form of a heart. Looks good enough to me. Now I'm going to put the cookie in the oven for about 15 minutes. Now that the cookies are out of the oven, it's time to call in some experts to put on some frosting. Now that the cookie's frosted, it's time to add some sprinkles. This has been another Cooking with Tavis. Happy Valentine's Day. That cookie looked amazing. Sure did. And now for some upcoming events. Winter sports are wrapping up. Girls basketball is ending on Monday with Hampton Dumont. Choice in the Challenges will be having Splash on February 7th and Cards for Valentine's Day on February 13th. Iowa assessments will be from February 7th through the 10th. Following the test, students will be using the two-hour late start schedule. There is a 7th and 8th grade band concert February 21st. 5th grade will be having their Valentine celebration at the end of the day on February 14th. That's all for now. Happy, Happy Valentine's, Valentine's Day from the middle. middle.